Basketball fans will always remember Kobe Bryant as a star, but those who live along this quiet neighborhood in the East say it was his time off the court they'll always treasure. And to come back and build for a community that needed it so much, you know, that's family. This play is spectacular. Remember in 2008, Bryant came to New Orleans for the NBA All-Star Game. It was then when he and other athletes partnered with Habitat for Humanity to help build a home for a mom and her three kids. Everybody has to make a contribution and they're helping hand. That's what we're here doing. All the players were incredibly gracious about signing autographs, giving hugs, letting people take their pictures, and just really being a presence and let people know that New Orleans was not forgotten, that they were really thinking and that they cared. One, two, three. three Three years post Katrina, New Orleans was just beginning its road to recovery. For those on Wilson Drive, hope had washed away. But this project Bryant was involved in helped build that back up. And I was right over here when the waters hit. And to come back and see people building for the community and give our neighborhood a chance to come back and live and be better than what it was, I love that. I remember him as a person, you know, him being who he is beyond the sport of basketball. So as we mourn his sudden death, here in New Orleans, his legend lives on. Here was a celebrity who cared, who stepped up, who gave back, uh, and he didn't just give cash. He gave with his hands and his heart, and he was there working side by side with local families to make New Orleans stronger and better. Remembering him not just as one great athlete, but as a person who helped out when it was needed the most. Get his own. My man. Jay Cunningham, Eyewitness News. Bryant worked alongside other stars like LeBron James, Ludacris, and Dwayne Wade. It was one of more than 200 homes Habitat for Humanity built that year.